The man behind the wheel is Jack Haynes, a long-haul trucker. On any other night, he'd be on the lookout for a good time. But that's changed. A lot has changed for Jack because of one overheard telephone conversation. He learned that tonight his wife is meeting another man here at the Mustang Bar. His name? Unknown. The only thing Jack Haynes knows for certain is that tonight there's going to be murder at the Mustang. A little place 10 miles from town. They're deep in the heart of the Twilight Zone. Here. You looking for somebody? Yeah. Yeah, I am. Regular? Could be. Well, if you tell me who it is, if I see him, I'll tell him you're here. All right, I'll find him. Suit yourself. Thank you. That's one of my favorite songs. I grew up listening to it. Now I'd like to try... I'd like to do one of my own songs. storm a few hours ago looking for a dry room and cold beer and a few hours work it turned out to be pretty good I figured I'd let him open for the house band tonight they're real natural that's probably why it took me a while to notice this guy is blind as a bat What did you think of my song? It's all right. You 
from around here? I'm new around here myself. Just felt like dropping by. I travel around a lot. By yourself? Well, you sound surprised. Is it is it because of these? Look, I'm sorry. I didn't mean anything. Look, I'd love to sit around here and chat with you, but if you don't mind, I've got something to do. Well, you never told me what you thought of my song. Kind of hits you where you live, don't it? That's what it was meant to do. You say this song is about me? Look, don't jerk me around. Not tonight. I've never seen you before in my life. That's right. So what makes you think you know all about me? I don't know all about you, just the bad things. See, I've been blessed. Or cursed, maybe, with a, with a talent. Sometimes the sounds just kind of come to me when I'm around certain people. And I'm one of those people. What do you think? I think you're full of crap. I'm doing just fine. I'm a lot happier than you'll ever be. Yeah, I, I suppose you're right. You're a real happy man. You're always telling the stories, hanging out, pulling little practical jokes, going on the road and having a good time. Yeah, you're a real happy-go-lucky type. Yeah, you're so happy you sat out there in your truck drinking until you was brave enough to come in here. You're so happy you came in here ready to blow somebody's brains out. Yeah, you're a real happy man. Oh, hell. Oh, thanks. I've been there. I'm not interested. It seems to me you're halfway there. Listen, I'm warning you. Don't mess with me or I swear I'll shoot me. Nuts. I don't think so. What are you gonna do? Call the cops? No. You really something, aren't you? I'll tell you what, Mr. Singer Man. You know so damn much about everything. Why don't you shave some of the time off my pain? Tell me which one of these bastards is running around with my wife. I don't know anything about your wife or what she's doing. I can only feel your pain, and there's gonna be a lot more of it if you go through with this. Will you look at that? What are you going to do, Jack? I'm just going to stand here and wait. What then? Oh, brother. Don't tell me she came here to meet him. Do it, Jack. Go off. Okay, give. What makes you so special? You mean the blonde? No, oh, the hairy truck driver. Yeah, the blonde. Money, charm, and, uh, Jeans. <laughs> you know what she wants me to do? I can't wait to hear. She wants me to get out of her face. <laughs> so you don't know her? Never seen her before in my life. Sure wish I did. You almost took out the wrong guy, Jack. Think about it, Jack. What if you find the wrong guy? What if... Why the hell don't you go bother somebody else? Because I'm not here for them. It really bothers you, doesn't it, Jack? The idea of your wife playing a little catch-up with what you've been getting away with for years. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Oh, come on, Jack. You've been running around on her and justifying it. Now you're worried she's doing the same thing. It's not the same. That's what you're telling me. The redhead in Detroit, the blonde in Toledo. You know what I think, Mr. Singer? I think you're not blind at all. Answer me when I talk to you. I'd say you just cut your answer, Jack. I was a 
surveyor then. Good one too. Folks said I had the eye for it. Anyway, I hit Philly. Five years ago, come Sunday. Got a job there. One night I was in this bar, kind of like this one, I suppose. And I met this redhead. Oh, we're drinking and dancing and having a good time. And then this guy comes up to me. Last thing I ever saw was that guy standing there. Funny thing was, I never saw the gun. It's just this bright flash, and the sound, big as the end of the world. It was the redhead's husband. And the slug went right through me. Come out here. Just kept on going. Went right through his wife. Killed her. A week later, the husband, he hung himself in his jail cell. I guess he couldn't live with what he'd done. To me, I got better after fashion. You know how they say when you lose one sense, the other ones get sharper? Well, I guess that's kind of what happened to me. I get a feel for people's pain. You know what it's like? It feels like sandpaper. It tastes like copper. Sounds like thunder. Close, get close. I could fix right in on it. Then about six months later, I found out the gift had a second part. The song or somebody come to me. Select that high level. I'll be drawn to a place I won't know who's there, or what I'm there to do. But after a while, the song comes. And I know. Jack, I've seen a lot of guys like you. Some listened and some didn't. Now you gotta decide for yourself, Jack. Hey, where are you going? Looks like her boyfriend showed up after all.
crazy? Come blow your brains out. Let the cops flush them out. You're going the wrong way, Jack. Even I can see that. Get out of my way! I can find you, you know they can find you. Why don't you try it? next week and she wanted to get something special for him. She'd been saving for months. You know? So we're, we're trying to think of something. And she came up with this idea, the truck, you know, Meg wheels or something, you know. It's kind of a surprise. God damn it, I, I don't understand why. You know, like, it lies! God! I know, it's a little thing I forgot to mention about the songs they sing. They got a real mean chorus. But it's your choice, Jack. And this time, it's for real. So what are you gonna do? Cold night. How did you know which truck? I almost threw it all away in there tonight. Yep. Look, is there something that I could? Well, could you give me a lift down the road? Got it. Look, I don't mean anything personal by this. I never heard of anybody getting shot like that. Surviving. Look, it's late. I got more songs to sing tonight. Better get going. Right. No comment necessary. Except to note the necessity of caution when the hands show midnight in the dark hour of the human soul. A song of warning and hope, written in somber red, and copyrighted by The Twilight Zone.